yeah, students so next part i just discuss the problem number 4 and 5 simultaneously i'll draw the problem number 4 and 5 the construct a pentagon of sides 25 mm by an extra exterior angle method similarly construct a hexagon base of 25 mm by exterior angle method so here the simple concept to draw the exterior angle it's nothing but ea is exterior angle it's completely 360 degree for a pentagon five numbers of sides 360 divided by 5 it's it may be 75 similarly external angle for a hexagon 360 divided by 6 total numbers of sides is 6 and this is 60 degree as considered as a external angle so initially i am dropping two numbers of line as consider as a base that could be that could be base of the pentagon and the hexagon so let me make a angular line that supposed to be 72 degree for a pentagon similarly this side it must be 72 degree so let me make an uh, inclined line considering outer so these two sides i am making 72 degree angular line from here only with respect to horizontal that is 72 degree similarly other side so i am measuring the base 25 mm for a pentagon i am intersecting this both angular line i am keeping that same edges a and b so now we need to identify the third point for the pentagon let it be c here there may be e c d here may be e at the same we need to find the another point that is e sorry d so let me measure the same dimension i am making an arc with c as a center similarly i am just making an arc e as a center you connect these two that will gives you the sides of the pentagon sides of the pentagon exactly you need to connect otherwise you may not get 25 mm length so this is a complete pentagon you need to draw okay so center for the pentagon to identify the center for the pentagon simply keep b as a center a as a radius simply mark here and a as a center simply make an arc so that point could be the center geometrical center for the pentagon in another way also you could able to identify the center similarly the exterior angle for an hexagon we need to take 60 degree 60 degree and similarly at b is 60 degree fine now we just connect these two lines you need not to connect much you just make a line for a certain distances that is sufficient otherwise it is overrated and erasing it's and all is too complicated now you measure ab as 25 mm and keep a as a center 25 mm as a radius similarly b as a center 25 mm as a radius now we got two points that we can name a b c d will come here e will come here f i am specifying these two points or f so remaining two points we need to identify for that you are at a vertical line from a and you are at a vertical line from b these two should be parallel now again the measured angle 25 mm and keep c as a center and that vertical line as a radius 25 mm as a radius you intersect that vertical line 
similarly keep up as a center and intersect that vertical line so this is d this is e so if you are connecting it you may get the regular hexagon that's it quite simple so to identify the center for the hexagon it may be otherwise if you are making a diagonal this point we are making a diagonal this point this point may be center for the pentagon let us name o this is you need to show the base 25 properly extend the line properly make a dimension line 25 right here pentagon right here hexagon thanks